It's at 720p. Uh, I don't know exactly how how tough it's going to be for me to keep it at 720p because my internet sucks, but... Oh. Oh, it's a bit loud. A bit loud, a bit loud. The Creative Business Unit 3. Oh! Wait, you're already getting the trailer? Oh, no, we're turning this up, man. Oh. Yo, who's this guy walking up? It's us, the warrior of darkness. Oh. Dude, we're, we have the lyrics now. We have the, the official lyrics. I love this track, man. It's so good. The final days were upon us. The fabric of the star had begun to fray. Its last rent by tooth and claw. I was a holy shit. So the final days has happened, I think. Oh, shit. Yo! We're there, bro! We're there! Sage! Sage class! This is Alpha Node. Oh! Are you alright? I can look after myself, you know. And I've had enough of this rush. Come on! Good personality mixed in this, man. Seemed doomed to unravel, and yet, what? There's Lunar Bahamut. There were those who stood. In oh no, that's, that's not Lunar Bahamut. That's Estinian. Estinian. My bad. My bad. Oh, we already know. The hour is come for each other. Oh. It's... Oh, holy shit. He's in one of the towers, I reckon. I'm pretty sure. Maybe one of the towers. The stage is set. But will I hear to play their part. Oh, beautiful transition. You took your time. Tis as we feared. The respite afforded this land was but fleeting. The end draweth nigh. Oh. It's the map, the symbolism with the map burning for the end of days, man. Look at this. This music is so good. This new area, fantastic new area. Oh, Tratia. The star still has secrets to tell. My girl. Charlian would keep its counsel while the world is lost to ruin. It would. Come what may, we shall live on. We must. Do as you must then. But we scions will fight. Until the heavens fall. Until our last breath. Ooh. 
Xenos, you crazy? Oh, he's got, he wanted to find a new weapon. He got us a scythe. Holy shit. Shit. Yo! Dude, this is so good. It literally feels like, it actually does feel like a huge conclusion and we know it is going to be a conclusion of like, you know, the first saga of Final Fantasy 14. It literally, I had to rewatch that trailer. I'm gonna stop it at certain bits. Uh, I'll probably edit it in the video because I'm watching Fan Fest at the moment, as you guys can probably tell. I'll, I'll stop it at certain bits and rewind it through the editing process, okay? <laughs> Okay, so here we are in the future. It's now on YouTube and everything. It's, I put it on 1080p, like super uh, full HD because I was watching a stream, like my internet is so crappy. It was only on 720. And uh, I just want to highlight some really huge bits that I picked out into this trailer. I'm so, so excited. Um, dude, I, I'm just so happy about this. And like I said before, it literally feels like the end. I guess like the first, the biggest bit, the walk up with uh, the map, I do want to point out, I guess I'll full screen this for now. The map, I want to pull point out that because it is the, literally the end and Walker, the symbolism with the map um, being burnt up and everything is is so badass, dude. And let's just watch Alice say this little scene again. I loved it. Look at this, dude. That's crazy. Oh, and we come in and the pitch change. Oh, did you hear that? Like, Soken's a genius, dude. I have so much respect for that man. Like, dude, like, literally listen to this, huh? When you go back here, you can hear this little pitch change and like the whole air changes when all the homies come through, right? What the hell Alice say? Mm -mm. And then the breakdown. We come through. Badass, great cinematography, fantastic musical journey stuff. I don't know. Let me see Sage. Looks like it has lasers and stuff like that. And obviously it's a hero class. So um, I do get excited. Lasers and stuff attached to the floating blades. Pretty sick, but uh. Oh. I, I can look after myself, you know. And like that, that like break in the dialogue for them to do it, it's perfect when Soken like um had had the female vocals come through and saying like to the end, like all that stuff, so so fitting and everything for them to have their moments. And I've had enough of this rush. Come on. Fucking love ILSA, dude. So badass. Hat personality. Also, this. As the chaos spread. The change to Heaven's Ward OST. The change to it. Literally, what I got from the show is what is embodying the entire story of Heaven's Ward, Stormblood, you know, ARR, and everything in, in that. And that's why it's genius, absolutely genius, that they they're having Astinian and his dragon. Um cool. there were those. Ooh. No helmet, by the way. Fucking badass, bro. Going to Stormblood? Exactly this. Combining everything for it in the track itself and pushing. It's literally the end, dude. And it's... Oh my god, it's so good. And I guess I'll fast forward to... And then we finally see here... Span creating an orange looking absolutely amazing. Look, look, look at these visuals, man. They look absolutely stunning. Thancred? Bruh. Oh, that's a bad, that's a bad frame. But you look, look how beautiful his face is. It's absolutely amazing. Ooh. Oranger and Thancred were trying to find ways to maybe prevent this from happening. But it seems like it's like 
this is the final confrontation. We need to get ready for, you know, the all out brawl towards the end. We tried everything we could, and it's probably maybe what the MSQ is going to be about and stuff, trying to prevent it. But ultimately, we're going to fight um, Fen Daniel and Xenos, you know? Ooh. Um, and let me just say, this female vocal, she's killing it, dude. She's absolutely destroying this shit. She raises the pitch here. It's going higher. Oh, hi. It's so good. And Gratia, my mans. And then the tone shifts. My God, there's so much stuff to unpack in this trailer. I hope that I don't bore you guys by talking about the, the just pure genius of the cinematography, the animation, and how it all comes together in a sense that like we're combining what we've learned in Heaven Sword, combining what we learned in Stormblood, ARR, and all of the characters together. And it's about our homies, right? Giant, ginormous confrontation with it. And it seems like the music and the tones and shifts are exactly that. Ooh. Let's just see this badass. Let's see it again with just solo again, okay? My girl, my girl. While the world is lost to ruin. It would. Come what may, we shall live on. Also, I think this is Alphino's dad. I'm calling it right now. Do as you must, then. But we scions will fight. Until the heavens fall. Until our last breath. She's beautiful, man. Mm. Overview. Xenos, this crazy pasta-haired demon man is the Reaper, the new class. Fantastic reveal. Uh, I want to fast forward to this part where it, it pans to everybody. Pans to all the characters, right? Estinian. Oranger. Dankrid. Gratia. Beautiful Yasola. Beast from the Amron as well. And you hear Emmett's uh, narration that we heard when we did the Amron dungeon and everything. Um, it, it literally, I think it is word for word verbatim what he was saying in the dungeon as well. So it literally is the final days. And Xenos was saying that he was seeing the dream over and over again. Don't know if that's like his destiny or something or if Daniel has something to do with it because he wants to destroy and obliterate everything. I guess we'll find out with that. But uh, you can tell the themes here are fantastic. You know, they're... And this tone. Dude, it's just so good. It's going. And then Ed Walker. People were kind of worried, me kind of included. Like, how can they top Shadowbringers? I mean, I thought that when I finished 5.0, and you guys know, and eventually when I release it, I was like, how are they going to top 5.3 in the conclusion of Shadowbringers? Um, with this trailer, with the themes and the uh, music arrangement from all of the other expansions, all of the other like uh, characters, the cinematography and everything, everything's in the on the line. For me, I was I was concerned that it wasn't actually gonna feel like a giant conclusion and fit into it. But this trailer and, and seeing it all and then re-watching it and you know analyzing thing with you guys and stuff. It truly feels like the end and i'm so fucking excited so there you guys have it it's kind of like my reaction to the trailers obviously and then me being able to go back when i had time and after fan fest because uh it's just so much content and so much stuff to see and i wanted to make sure i was available for it so hopefully you guys did enjoy my little bit of like my little take on what i see from the trailer or like what i think what's going to happen or like how it's all gonna play out um i'm i just like spitballing it's just my my thoughts and everything take it with a grain of salt and then stuff and i would really love to hear your guys' thoughts and what you think um uh, you see personally in the trailer and what does that spell for like, the msq and stuff like that please have that discussion in the comments and everything i would love to to read some of your guys interpretations i just love hearing um, more from you guys in the final fantasy 14 community i love it and honestly i pre-ordered and walker i haven't pre-ordered a video game since halo 3 
way, way back when I was a tiny child. If you guys did enjoy the video, please be sure to give it a like. If you aren't already subscribed, please do so for some more Final Fantasy 14 content or content in general. I'll be here and I just want to take the time and you know, thank you guys for everybody who watched all the way to the end, especially the highest tier Patreons, Daddy Senpai and Socratic Ren. Continue to show your amount of love and support and I really do appreciate it. Um, So yeah, uh, make sure to comment down below your thoughts on the fan fest and what you guys think personally of the trailer and the stuff. Um, I have a lot more fan fest ish kind of videos coming out, but as well, I have the MSQ that I'll eventually um, get to the conclusion of Shadow Bringers and stuff like that out for you guys. And so be on the lookout for that. And yeah, I hope to see you guys on the next video. Peace out.